I know I'm gonna have a lot of family, friends, um, hopefully fans there. <laughs> so I'm excited. Just past the halfway mark of the 2012 Big Ten season, the Boilermakers find themselves atop the league standings. Next up for the Boilermakers, a completely unfamiliar opponent as Purdue welcomes conference newcomer Nebraska to Mac Arena for the first time ever. Still, despite the fact that these two programs have never played, a few Boilermakers are more than a little familiar with their opponent. Well, my sister played for University of Nebraska. She just finished up her senior season. I was a fan. I like her and her teammates are pretty cool too. So me and my parents tried to make as many of the games as possible. So and the coaching staff, you know, I'm pretty familiar with them. So when we play them, it'll be kind of still a rivalry thing. It's awesome. That means that, you know, um, I get to go home and play in front of my family, my friends, um, in front of the state of Nebraska. Um, you know, and it's great for Nebraska to come into a conference like the Big Ten. Um, they'll be academically, they're awesome, so it'll fit in with us and same um, sports-wise. So I'm excited. I'm ready to go home and play in front of everybody. Hauser and her team will have to wait until next season to travel to Lincoln as the Boilermakers and the Cornhuskers play just once this year. It's an unexpected development for KK as Nebraska seemed to be firmly ensconced in the Big 12 when she committed to Purdue just a few years ago. Now with the Big Red joining the Big 10, it allows for connections and opportunities previously unimaginable. One of my good friends plays on the volleyball team at Nebraska, so it's more been like a, I can't wait till you come to Purdue or you know things like that to cheer her on and stuff like that. So more of like, um, it's really cool that our teams are going to be competing against each other. Um, but other than that, I have a ton of people who are ready to, for me to come home and watch me play. Nebraska enters the contest, trailing the Boilermakers by just a single game in the Big Ten standings. Thursday's battle could prove very important by the end of the year. Just one more step in the odyssey of the 2012 season.